what's happening. So today we're gonna make hamburger sliders. Woo you gotta shape it into a patty. Same patty day. You gotta keep making it look like a circle, kind of like a hockey puck, but not really. Flatten it up, twist it around. Patty cake, patty cake, bakers make. Yes. Once you have it formed, place it on a plate with parchment paper so it doesn't stick to the plate when you're making these hamburgers the ground beef will shrink when you cook it when you're making more put another parchment paper on top and the extras on top again because we are about to put it in the fridge gotta cool it down while we prep all the ingredients we got this beautiful buttery brioche bun cut it in half so beautiful and a perfect circle butter up that frying pan lay down those baby buns and I got my booty bun. Once you fried them from the bottom and top, you're good. Time to get some lettuce. Rip apart each lettuce because we're about to cut them into perfect circles. I use this baking tool. It's like a circle baking tool to cut dough. You could also use this to cut lettuce. For the extra lettuce, you can feed them to your turtle, to your rabbit, or make a salad. Here's a video of the turtle enjoying the lettuce. I named him Danny after my dad. Let's get some tomatoes tomato yum yum just do a regular slice we also got some pineapple oh yeah baby who lives in a pineapple under the sea i love that theme song this is how you perfectly peel the pineapple once you have them sliced up into circles you gotta cut the middle part if you have one of these it's from a piping bag it's a piping tip you can make a hole right in the middle to make a perfect shape if not it's all good you can cut it with a knife we got that mushroom. Shroomy shroom shroom. You gotta cut it diagonal. Get the aesthetics. It's like tic-tac-toe, but sideways. Cause we're about to sear it. Get some red onion. Beautiful. Regular onion. Delightful. Next up, we're gonna make aioli sauce. And these four ramekins is considered to be for four different burgers. These all have mayonnaise and we're gonna make aioli sauce. Aioli sauce is basically like seasoned mayo in a fancy way. Fancy. I put Himalayan salt. If you don't have Himalayan salt, you can just put regular salt on each mayo. The second one, I put sesame oil and mixed it. That one's for the pineapple burger, aka Hawaiian burger. The third one, I put organic black truffle olive oil. Truffle is bomb. It has like this umami flavor. You just gotta try it one day. If you ever come across the truffle, ooh, you'll be amazed. Also, I put lemon zest to get that kick flavor and mix it all together is for the hot cheeto burger this one has paprika papa papa paprika and mix it in with lime zest so delicious also with lime juice and mixed it now we have all our aioli sauce ready to go remember that portobello mushroom we're gonna sear it you can just put any oil on the pan i use olive oil i also added the pineapple just to cook at the same time it's fine unless you're allergic be careful Get your patties from the fridge. Have it set up because we're about to season them with salt, black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, and flip it because you got to season the other side. The other side, the other side of beef. Have some oil ready on your pan and sizzle, sizzle. Keep flipping them probably like four times because you want to make sure it's cooked all the way. I got this tool. I usually use this tool for potato mashing, but you can use this tool to stick it down to the beef and flatten it up. Oh, and I added too much oil. Shh. You can just drain it out. Time for the hot Cheetos. My favorite. Let's mush it up in a bag and have that ready for the preparation. Here's the setup. We got tomatoes, provolone, cheddar cheese, lettuce, red onion, regular onion, pineapple, portobello mushroom, the aioli sauces, the beautiful buns, and patties. Here is the regular American burger. You got the bun, aioli sauce, cheddar cheese, tomatoes, lettuce, regular onions, and the top bun. Hawaiian burger, bottom bun, the sesame aioli sauce, beef patty, cheddar cheese, pineapple, red onion, and the top bun. Up next, the third bun, which is the portobello mushroom burger. We got the bottom bun with the lemon zest truffle aioli. Spread it around, both bottom and top, beef patty, provolone, and that nice looking mushroom with tomatoes, regular onions, and the top bun. Ooh, next up is the hot cheeto hot dog. Hot dog, I mean hamburger, haha. <laughs> We got the paprika aioli onto the buns. I put the beef patty inside the bag full of hot cheeto crumbs and swirl all around. Make sure it's all covered up onto the patty. Provolone cheese, red onion, lettuce, tomatoes, and the top bun. Oh, by the way, with our American burger, I put a cordoshon on top. Cordoshons are like small pickles. Voila! Look at these four different beautiful buns. Bum -ba -dum -bum buns. Hamburger sliders. So happy and delicious. Time to eat.